all roads today lead to the San Siro here in Milan. It's the Derby della Madonnina, Milan against Inter. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary, as always on these special occasions, is Stuart Robson. Stuart, what are you looking forward to seeing in this one? Well, Derek, I have to say, this is always a game I look forward to, particularly the styles of play. Milan against Inter, this is a wonderful arena. Let's hope it's an entertaining game as well. The Inter team, Samir Handanovic begins in goal. Milan Striniar plays alongside Stefan de Vrij in central defence. Hakan Chalhanolu starts alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And Edin Dzeko starts alongside Lautaro Martinez. This is the Milan starting 11. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Teo Hernandez starts with Davide Calabria in the fullback positions. And leading the attack today, Zlatan Ibrahimovic. And the game begins. Free kick awarded then by the referee. is on, body on the line. A chance maybe from the wide position. Ibrahimovic at the ready. Not out of the woods yet. And relief as the keeper holds on. Well, he reacts so quickly, doesn't he? That's a great bit of work from him. Matteo Damian. Well, Inter have played some wonderful football in front of their own fans this season. And just look at that record, Stuart. Well, eight wins from ten games shows just how good they've been at home. And it's their fluidity of movement which has caused so many problems. That will be the case again today, I'm sure. Now that short pass, this could be interesting. Perisic. And it went sailing over the crossbar. Not a moment he'll want to remember. here oh, lovely incisive pass could it be a goal into take the lead in the derby and how much does it mean to them just listen well here's the goal again and it's a really nice ball to put him through the vision to set up the chance is outstanding and there's certainly no doubt about the finish he really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. <laughs> it's 
So Milan get the ball moving once more. How will they react? Alert defending. Barella. They might be able to get in now. Perisic. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Chalanolu. And offside by the merest of margins. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Dzeko. Martinez. And a goal to increase their advantage. It's a two-goal lead now. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power. But just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. Second goal for them here. Well, he could really get at the opposition. Brahim. And he takes on the shot. Well, the keeper wanted to take it cleanly and did. Useful looking position, you've got to say. He could pick out a teammate. And using his body to good effect. Could reduce the deficit. Marvellous anticipation. A goal! And it's very much game on here. Well, here it is again, and it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. Well, the ball is rolling again. Palpable sense of belief in the Milan camp. Jekko. And now they have the ball back. Sandro Tonali. On to Ibrahimovic. And that's a well timed pass. Offside it is. Such a pity for him. Well, he thought he was onside, but I think the assistant got that absolutely right. Jekko. Martinez and throwing himself up the ball. Well, opting for the short corner. Chalanolu. Rob them. And you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. A 
And now Perisic. Oh, tremendous header that time. But the goalkeeper was there. A corner will ensue. Well, he's gone short with it. Brahim. Rafael Leao. It's a promising Milan move. And players waiting in the centre. Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. Kessie. On to Ibrahimovic. Now they've lost it. Ibrahimovic. And there it is, a chance. Well, he really wants his brace. Well, he looks so bright today. His movement has been excellent. Let's see about the delivery. Oh, how did he get there? Hantanovic with the save. So the corner played into the box. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. This could be the equaliser. But oh, what an important save. How about that? Well, at least he hit the target, but he should really beat the keeper from there. They should be level now. Kessier. And options in the centre. Cut again from the flank. And the referee blows for half time. We shouldn't be shocked about the current score line. And they get the ball rolling in the second half. Inter hold the advantage, but it's a long way from being done and dusted. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Brahim. Now potential danger. And not cleared away properly. In it goes at the second time of asking. But the goalkeeper won't be proud of that moment. Well, when you look at this again, there's two things wrong defensively about this. First of all, the goalkeeper should not be parrying it into a dangerous area, and the defenders have to be sharper to get to the knockdown. It's not good defending all round. So, underway again at 2 all. Chalanolu Martinez Good visualisation and execution Kessier This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity This looks promising 
Cuts it back. Good looking pass. Excellent passing. To jump in front. Oh, really close. Just over the top. Chalanolu, Alessandro Bastoni. It's with Chalanolu. Barella. Jeco. The ball with Martinez. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. And Milan could get in behind the defence. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Caranolu. Barella. Matteo Damian. And with tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved a booking for that. To the box it goes. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. A fine reading of the situation. Damian. Martinez. It's with Chalanolu. Perisic. Well, no examination at all for the goalkeeper. And on that basis, he's got to be a bit cross with himself. Sandro Tonali. Rebic has it. Brahim. And Milan moving the ball with purpose. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Skriniar. That's how to rob them of possession. Successfully cut out. <laughs> Martinez being pressed hard. Now well, space for Inter in the wide position. Prepared to fire. Now he must get it out of there. And breaking at pace with Menace. Looks as though they might make real progress on the counter attack. Not so. Jekko.
Kessier. On the attack, is there to be late drama? Ibrahimovic waiting. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Ivan Perisic. Dzeko. Barella. Oh, the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. Well, he's certainly been warned, Stuart. No more challenges like that. Well, he's in no doubt now. He can't foul again. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Firing it towards goal! Well, he had it on target, but it was never going to trouble the keeper. And just five minutes remaining. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Barella. Now Dzeko. Oh, fine save. And it remains all square. Well, he saved his team there. That's a big moment for the keeper. Well, the fans are making so much noise here. They believe the winner's coming. But it needs a moment of inspiration for one of those players out on the pitch. What a finale we've got. Milan still on the attack and the game's waning moments. Still level. What can they do from this corner? The minutes ticking away in this game. And a double substitution it's going to be. And three minutes of stoppage time to be added on. The high press was very much on. Oh, a nice looking pass. And a goal! Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And the timing of the run is just as good. As for the finish, it was never in doubt. And the referee blows his whistle and it brings an end to this contest and the story here defeat for Inter well this was always going to be a close game but despite their brilliant home form I think they were slightly negative in their approach today and as a result they always look second best in key areas 